great job winning the game. Congratulations. Yeah, it was really impressive. I'm glad Coach Bragg started getting the kids in shape. So what brings you to the administration office tonight? Oh yes. Is the door not open? He may have gone to bed. Let me make sure. Just go check and see if Albert is still there. Ernest, yeah, don't quit your day job, Ernest. So, sounds like you've had an eventful evening. First you score the last touchdown of the season, and you get a coveted post with vault security. You're shaping up to be a real mover and shaker. What do you plan to do next? I escape, escape and start my own empire. Yeah, that. Ha, such a... Now listen to you, kid. I've got that Bragg fellow beating the election by 10 points, but that doesn't mean he's out of the game. Bragg offered you that post with his freaky sister down in security. I want to know why. What did he offer you, and what does he expect in return? Service to my country. <laughs> Maybe. Possibly. Bragg is the vault sweetheart. He's a hard liner, big on security, low on spending. I get that, but the man is a tyrant. He's been driving these kids like dogs, and not just on the field. He has them running laps with machine guns, for God's sake. You know about his after-school program, those long speeches about America and restoring it to purity? Do you know what kind of a man fills a child's head with those machinations? A dictator. I'm worried that after Bragg loses the vote for the overseer's office, he won't take it peacefully. That's why I called you up here to get your perspective. Well, you don't like Bragg's Patriots training program? I mean, what? Aren't you the one that authorized it, Christensen? I didn't. Chevy demanded. Oh, nope. The Wasteland Scouts, ah. and Yeti, they didn't sanction it either. When that dry hoppy took over, she set her one foot eye <laughs> on making Vault 18 their private fortress. With whatever it was Rossman did to piss off our upstairs friends in the wasteland, the old folks down here have been running scared. We're an elderly vault, kid. 80% of our inhabitants are in nursing care. They're afraid. They jump at their own shadow. You tell them all the ghost stories about vault vikings and psychos blowing up the vault door? No wonder they're out looking for a man like Bragg. <laughs> this isn't going to be an easy talk, kid. Well, they're, more, they're looking for more than just Bragg. They're probably also looking for me. <laughs> the character. Training is patriot day and night. I'm worried the whispers may be true. What do you know about Bragg and Chevy's plans tomorrow? They gave you that post in security. You've got to have heard something. I love watch his reaction. They got they got too. How much of that macho bullshit has gone to your head? Are you more interested in protecting the vault or that cockamamie? America, cult garbage. Christensen reminds me of all the fucking liberal idiots nowadays. They're like the the moment you freak out on some, the moment you say something they don't like, they f they flip out on you. It's like what you don't have any pride in your own damn country. I don't know what to believe. You know those crazy half-cocked patriot types. One minute they're talking jibber-jabber political nonsense, the next they're waving guns in your face. <laughs> yeah. I voted last season to let the gun controls in Vault 18 run wild. Now they're everywhere, but only his kids know how to use them. They outnumber Vault security three to one. We didn't let this happen, they created it. So what do you want me to do about it? I want you to keep an eye on them. Watch what they're doing. Report back to me. If the Patriots are up to something, we ought to know about it. And... Here we go. Jesus Christ, threats? If you think your attitude is winning you any favors... Just, just get out! Go! Deflate Bragg's balls or whatever it is you wasteland kids do after a game. Ha! <laughs> 
Okay, hold on. You, you have been on the rat. You've been drinking too much. I am just going to take that empty bottle, so you won't won't be trying to drink anymore. And I can't get in there. Damn. Bite me, Ernest. Well, oh, hold on. Sorry, but the music, the radio, goes off. Because YouTube's broken ass content ID system doesn't know how to register that music in a game is music in a game and technically by play by playing the game you actually do own the damn rights to it. And it oh damn it what Oh yeah, I won't let me get in there yet. Damn doors. And all the Ooh, I can take. Can I take the teddy bear? No, damn! Won't let me take it. I can take that. And let's bug the shit out of Johnny. You motherfucker! The hell are you doing out on that fucking field? You nearly broke my fucking kneecap. I'm going to be flying at half mast the rest of the goddamn night. Ha! <laughs> Like, you're such a s <laughs> I, Either we can be ultra nice, which my character isn't, yet. <laughs> like, you're such a Saint Methison. Why don't you get your basement trash mom to kiss it better? You and Bragg's <laughs> drooling patriot thugs are better watch where you step. This is the last time the Vault Barbarians take your shit. Just remember this. It's us basement trash keeping the lights on while you bitches parade around Bragg's star spangled dick upstairs. Fuck you, and fuck all your pussy friends. When we take over this vault, you're kinda done for. Try it, you mewling degenerates, what? I'm gonna be the first one to string you up if you patriot thugs try anything tomorrow. Just give me an excuse. Oh, hey, Johnny. I found your jet inhaler. I'm taking it. Uh, can't take that because that's part of the heart thing. Uh, I'm taking all this. Hey, thanks to the stim pack and the bone saw. Yeah, for some reason, it. It shows up as invisible when it's on this thing until you wear it. And hi. I guess you can't talk much. Can't use the chemistry set yet. And I can't use that yet. Can I get into any of these rooms? Oh yeah, I can. I can get into this one. But unfortunately, there's nothing in there. It's just a changing room. Okay, come on. That's inaccessible. And that's inaccessible. Later, Matheson. Yeah, I can't access that yet. 
C3, okay. Go back and talk to Coach Bragg and then go to bed. Hey, kid. Hi. It's kind of funny because I know it's a preset, but she looks like Sally from... Oh. Oh, there you go. Come on. Kick the ball. There we go. Yeah, that one little girl, she looks like Sally from the Mothership Zeta DLC from Fallout 3. I know it's probably just like a tip. Oh, wait, what? Why is that in the red? Okay, there. Okay, now there we go. I don't know. I maybe it was because it was after ten, and that technically my character was out after curfew. Baseball. I'll take that. And they're not there right now. Office. Okay. Oh. Okay. There we go. I forgot I have to wait after a while. Oh, hey, get back here. It's about time for you to go to bed, ain't it? Start playing. Uh. Great questions. What is it? Any more books on fighting, Coach? As a matter of fact, yes, I do. Guns and Ammo, Pugilism Illustrated, and a few Grognak comics I lifted off that dumb punk Johnny. Ha! Feel free to let him know where you got him. Kick his ass for me if he tries to take them back. <laughs> Do you have anything to say now? Nope. That door is inaccessible. Hi there. Hi. Time to go to bed. I see Kurtz has been busy. And that's still okay. And Oran, yeah, that's us. Well, technically not Welcome like back. real. Yay! It's our hero. Great work, Alfie. 
Note to Senator Skulls from vault -Tec. Congratulations on the successful launch of Vault 18 and its soon-to-be-completed segments. We're sorry to note that the terrarium and several sections of excavated caverns never met their completion time before the world was lit ablaze by an atomic flame. But we, but we assure you that the Terratech droids will have them ready in no time. We hope that you and your daughter enjoy your stay with vault -Tec. For a better tomorrow. Holy crap, that sounded. I don't know if that sounded bad, cr cringe, or almost like what you read in the fall real Fallout terminals in Fallout 1 and 2 3. Uh, from Miss G. You have pages 4 through 25 of the Merits of Capitalism due Monday. Please don't be late just because of the big, of the big game. We have the Civil War to cover next week. Oh, God. <sighs> oh, yeah. I, I named my character Derpy Hooves. You were fantastic. Even, yes. you know... Even though it's te even though the character is actually technically my OC, oh, yeah, it's Derpy Hooves is just her alias for right now. Sean, what? Hey. I thought we were gonna try to fake it. Fake what? I'm sorry about missing your big game. We just really wanted to get into this RPG before the next wave of tests in chemistry. Uh. Hey, I heard you won. Congratulations. Yeah, it would have been nice to have family there. Yeah, I know what you mean. I'm sorry. We're alone enough as it is. We should have been there for you. Being orphans, people treat us a little differently. It's nice to know we're yeah. in a better place than we would have been, but I wish we were treated equally here. Do you ever think about them? Yeah, sometimes. I've read the reports, heard the rumors. I even looked at our gene projections once. Sean and I are from the same mom as you, but we have a different dad. It's really made me want to learn our history, you know? Yeah. What were they like? Where were they? Maybe we'll never know. The place they found us is over a hundred miles away. They could really be dead. Or worse. Kira's always believed they were kidnapped. She's a weird girl, though. I'm not ready to believe her. She's too yeah. like her adopted parents. Ready to stab you in the back. Hey, she said it rough. Not really. She should see how people treat their children in the wasteland. From what Dr. Rossman says, it's hell. They're all slaves or just used as soldiers. I don't want to gossip. I'm not like the other vault dwellers. Did you want to ask something else? Nah, eh, I'm going to head to bed. Oh, all right. Have a good night. I'll try to play quietly. It's kind of hard for you to play when I just, when I just jacked your guitar. Oh, pfft. wow. So she pulls another one out of her ass. Okay. Well, you'll see that every day. But before I go to bed, I'm breaking the fridge. Ha! Yes. End the prologue. Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot. Now I can edit my name. There we go. Bye bye. <laughs> I just like, I go to bed and I level up. I need a max out survival later. Okay. And another one. Okay. 
Wow. I think the black one will perk now. That will be easier when I get to the Mojave. And... There we go. Ha! <laughs> three... It's like, what, three times I level up during the night? <laughs> now, you boys play this one real close. Close to the vest, and the overseer won't know what he hit him. The time for a revolution. Oh, he could not do that. Oh, God, wow. We just got word from the president. We have to make our move tonight. John, Is it because I'm recording? Henry has a real sense of time and donate how long do we have a little over 48 hours we have to Ugh. it was pop the cutscene probably got choppy because during recording ow that almost what that almost that th that threw me into the wall it did! It threw me into the ground! What the hell is going on? Oh. Long live the Enclave. That's for trying to hit on my sis, on my stepsister. I shot you. I shot your arm off. Okay, take now. And take that, 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 and that. Hey, you, over there. Are you one of us, or are you one of them? Yours, why the hell wasn't I informed of this? The Colonel trusts you, even above the rest of us. Why weren't you with the opening attack? There must be some mistake. We should report back to the colonel and sort this out. Yes, exactly. The colonel will inform you of what's happened. Come on. Good. Come with me. Even though I barely use any G weapons on this character, typically. Okay, there we go. Come on, let's go.
also there's a Fallout 3 mod that completely rewrites the story to be from the Enclave perspective. I may download that uh, later um, and play through it as as my character. Just to, just to add to her backstory, because my Also, in this, there's a unique 9mm uh, submachine gun. I know uh, people are always complaining about the, like, the combat, uh... I love this. Ha! And there he goes. You patriot bastards. Oh, hold on. No, right now. Oh, yeah. My carry rate is... <laughs> Yeah, I have a mod that gives me Applejack's uh, character hats. Uh, hmm? Okay. Time to take a break. <laughs> 